Hi friends, this is Kansi from Atop Serenity Hill, and today I wanted to share a post that I put on Instagram that seemed to have resonated with so many of you as creatives. And as I read it to you, I wanted to invite you to watch what I'm doing, which is just a fast forward video of a page that I created that started so crazy and then ended up wonderful because I kept at it and kept experimenting and kept trying. So here's what the post had to say. Have you ever found yourself excited to create? You start playing in your art journal and then this conversation happens in your head. Okay, I started. I glued all the stuff down, but then what? What do I do next? How do I know what to do next? Here's what I want to share with you. There is no right or wrong move. Do anything. Pick a color, an art supply, a technique. Ask your gut, your heart, your whole body. Yes or no? Yes, use it. No, pick something else. Trust your gut. Practice listening to your intuition. There is no right or wrong next move. If yes or no feels too much, pick three things. Which one is the strongest maybe? Use that. It is all an experiment. Use the good and the ugly to show you what to do or not to do next time. Take all the information and try again. There is no right or wrong next move. There is only play, fun, trial and error. There is only the picking up of the paintbrush, the stencil, the collage bit, and putting it on paper. This is not brain surgery, but if you keep doing it, trusting it, delighting in it, it might just save your life. My beautiful creative friends, there is no right or wrong next move. I believe and trust enough for you. Paint it, doodle it, glue it, stencil it, stamp it, just do something. And most of all, have fun doing it. This post, which I just read, was so powerful for a lot of people, giving them permission to just go for it, to put something down, let it be ugly, let it be the best thing they've ever done. Just an invitation, my friends, to start and just see where it goes. Play experiment, use that curiosity, trust your gut. It knows. Sometimes you just have to listen to it. If you want to see this art journal page come together in real time, I will link below the video that it was a part of on YouTube here about seven months ago, where I actually talked through the whole thing. So you could see where I was making decisions, where I changed things, how it started one way and ended up in a completely different uh, format, whatever, you know, it just came out completely different than how it started. So check out that link below and go grab your art supply, any art supply, pop it on a surface and just start. Thanks friends. I'll see you soon.